Hello guys, Undead Creeper here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install the, sorry if I pronounced this wrong, Tatao Items Mod. And you want to go to this page, all these links are in the description, and you're going to find your language and English is right here, and you're going to click on 32-bit or 64-bit. And you want to see where your computer is, so you're going to right-click computer, click properties, and that should tell you where it is, what uh, type of bit yours is, and mine 64, and I already have it installed. And you want to go to the Forge page, and you want to go to 7.8.0 for Minecraft 1.5.2, and you're going to see Universal, and you're going to click on the Add Fly link, and I already have that installed right here. And once you have that, you're just going to go to the Forum page, you're going to scroll down, and you're going to see Download. Click on the spoiler, and this will be version 1.5.2. Click on the Media Fire link, and it's going to take you to this page, and just click Download. And there we go. It's downloaded. Show in folder. Now I can. I don't care about that. But now we can just bring that to your desktop. There you go. And once you have that, you're gonna do your Minecraft. And click Options, Force Update, and then log in. And you're gonna do this because uh, if you have any mods, they may not com be compatible. So you have to just like wipe out all that stuff. And if you don't want to lose all your other mods, you could just copy the .minecraft folder and put it somewhere else. Here we go. And this is all you need to do with your Minecraft right now. And while that's loading, I'm going to go click on here and go to your percent app data percent. And you're going to go to your .minecraft, go to your bin, and you're going to see Minecraft right here. This thing should be done. Guess it's not. We're just gonna have to wait for this to load. It may take a little bit while longer. There we go. Now I can just exit out of this. Go to your wrong thing. Go to your folder and right-click your Minecraft and open with Render Archiver. And make sure your uh, Minecraft does not open or you will not be able to open it. But once you have that, you can just uh, minimize that. But you're, you're going to open your Minecraft.jar and you're going to see your meta in folder. You're going to have to delete this. It does not allow mods in the Minecraft client. And then once you have that, you can open up your Minecraft Forge and drag it over to the side. And you're going to see there's a meta in folder in the Minecraft Forge. Just leave it there. Then click Control A to highlight everything in the Minecraft Forge and drag it over into the class files. And make sure you do not put it into a folder or those will not work. And you'll just get like uh, your Minecraft will crash, or you'll just get a black screen. And then once you have that, you can just exit out of both of them, and then you can open up your Minecraft again. And if you guys ever get like a white screen, just force update and then try it over again, because it's really easy to mess up. And here we go. And again, this will take longer than usual. Here we go, and you're gonna see. Right here, there's the mods uh, tab, and you can see they have Minecraft Coder Pack, Forge Mod Loader, and Minecraft Forge. And if you do not have one of these, you should force up, update your Minecraft again and then retry my steps. And once you go out of there, you go to back to your percent app data, and then you're going to see a mods folder was created. You can click on it, and then you're going to drag in the te sorry if I pronounced this wrong again, Tahu Items Mod. And once you have that, you can open up your Minecraft again. And when you log in, it should be done. And if you guys are wondering what this tab right here is, you set it's just Minecraft Forge. And the first time you load Minecraft Forge, it will take longer than usual because it has to create uh, like the mods folder, core mods folder, and etc. So here we go. And now you see there's four mods loaded. And it's a Japanese mod, so I can't read that. But once you have that, I'll just show you guys that it works. Single player. Here you go. And let's go. There we go. And I'll show you guys all of spawn. I don't need that. But I'll show you guys all of the different stuff that it comes with. Here's the spell card, and they have all of this stuff. I, th I don't even know what they do. Okay. Spell card. Let's see all the different stuff it adds. 
here we go. I'll show you guys this, whatever it does. I don't, I have no idea what it does. There we go. Well, uh, this thing adds so many, like, freaking awesome animals. And it, they, like, roam around your world. I think they might disappear. Yeah, but, and it has, like, show you guys all the items again. Has loads of stuff. Look at all this stuff. There's, like, Stick of Regret, Scythe of Death, The Dipper, Third Eye. There's, like, so much cool stuff. Let's try this on chicken. See how much it does. And, uh, yeah, that's how you install it. Please remember to leave a like, favorite, and subscribe if you haven't already. And check out my Hunger Games and how to get banned from a Minecraft server. So, yeah. Uh, peace out, and again, do not forget to like and subscribe, and peace out. See ya. I'm gonna pop some tags, only got twenty dollars in my pocket. I'm, I'm looking for a cover. This is being awesome.